Here's the quick and easy way to set up your AI search campaigns and my advice on how to set it up properly. AI search campaigns are kind of like a dynamic search ad mixed with a performance max. So what I recommend is to copy and paste your most generic campaign. So hit the edit, hit copy, and then you see this paste icon eventually, and then you hit paste and then wait for it. And eventually it'll just paste kind of like this one. I recommend renaming it to like AI Max, have the location modifier. So if this is in Melbourne, you do Mel, and then what is the service? So it might be all services or something like that, right? Next, you want to go over to your campaign settings. So click this little cog button, we'll go over to here. Now you can click optimize with AI Max. And the reason we duplicated one of our old campaigns is just to simply test the AI Max against our other campaign that's already working. So you might wanna add the final URL, but have some exclusions here or exclusion rules. So for example, an exclusion rule might be like anything that says blog in the URL structure so that I'm not you know, sending people to my blog, etc. Define these rules and click save so that they're exclusions. Once you've set up all those exclusions, you then go over to your brand exclusions. You don't want want your brand to show up in any of the searches. You don't want any of the terms you've already won simply because you're trying to get people who've never heard of you before usually. Click save. And then from there, all the other settings are pretty much stay the same. And that's all there is really to it. The issue here is that it's gonna take some stuff from your existing website, like a dynamic search ad does and like a performance max does. It's gonna try to send to the most relevant URLs. And this is why I recommend that people split test and try this against other campaigns. Like. I wouldn't just put it in a black and white bucket and say that AI Max doesn't work or AI Max does work. I would test it against every single account that you can. Or if you if you don't have a dedicated budget to test it, then you might want to create an experiment, a custom experiment. I've got another video on that and then duplicate an existing campaign. And the only difference you'll make is turn AI Max on, that's it. That's my recommendations on setting up your AI Max. It's super, super simple. If you've got any questions, more than happy to answer them and I'll see you in the next video.